family. I hope you're doing well today. I want to thank you for all of your messages about the value that you've been receiving from my videos and posts. Um, I'm grateful to you for the encouragement uh, and I'm, I'm grateful that the encouragement and inspiration that I am providing is helping. So I want to talk to you about something today that's been on my heart. I need you to know that your emotional health is as important as your physical health, maybe more so. So you've got to manage your emotions at home, in the grocery store, at work, wherever you are, because guess what? Wherever you are, they're right there riding shotgun with you. <laughs> this is so important though, because it will save you lots of heartache and grief. Listen, you've been through a lot. And thank God you don't look like what you've been through. But if you don't examine and manage your feelings, you'll be picking up the pieces of dysfunction for the rest of your natural life. What am I saying? What you saying, Dr. Bro? If you typically overreact to petty disagreements and harmless things that people may say to you, consider that your anger and upset is misplaced. Your reaction is way over the top. I need you to check yourself if it is. Take a breath and notice your behavior, then self-correct. Recognize that you're triggered and that you own your stuff because your overblown reaction has nothing to do with what's in front of you and everything to do with what you left behind. You got to go back and deal with the hurt, whatever hurt you, and stop carrying it around and pulling it out in a, at inappropriate times and dabbing it behind your ear like a new perfume. <laughs> Here's what I want you to do. I have three things, three steps that can help you. When you feel yourself being triggered, pause. Then ask yourself, what is, what is, where is this coming from? It probably goes way back to long ago. Write your feelings in a journal and then analyze them. Keep asking what's really going on because it's probably related to feelings that you developed about your self-worth a long time ago. When we don't, you know, value ourselves, when our self-worth is at stake, everything and everyone else is the problem. It's not. Give yourself a break and heal. Start healing now.